Good afternoon, everybody. I'm going to talk about the S&P 500, and I'm also going to speak a little bit again on the actual volatility and things that we have warned people with before the fact, not after the fact. So here we go. We're going to go right back up here, and this is a daily chart, and what we're going to do is take a look at that volatility on a daily level so if we break below uh, 2043 these markets are going to sell down and it would be another rapid daily sell that would happen in the market so basically when we take a look at the daily let's just take a look and uh, see what we did right here because you know what it's very important that all of these daily simple moving averages, the red line is a 20 day, the um, moving averages is where usually if they start to fall below them, we have a 10 day simple moving average in the blue line right here, or aqua line. The white line is a 50 day. We went down here below it. Now, listen, they managed to get this back above that uh, 2043. On this intraday level they did break below it and then of course right now as we have clearly stated on several occasions here we are in the S&P 2085 reversal we said that from the very top of that S&P 52 week high there's going to be a 20% correction and you know when I said that we said that well if you don't believe it it's right here S&P 500 index 20% correction. This was, uh, we put this out on 5.5. 5. Today is 5.17. Daily moving averages, 50 day moving averages getting killed. Um, we're closing below it. The uh, 10, 40 day, and the 20 day, we're closing below it. The 10 day simple moving average at 20.59. And basically, we're not done. The volatility yesterday up moved and got slammed right back down and we did make a lower low than what we had yesterday and we made a lower low than here and basically we're testing over here where we had support and they had a three-day pump and dump to the high with an immediate reversal and another reversal and another reversal and guess what another lower low than what we had the other day so here's how it works that's going to be that support level and we're going to continue to sell down I have before us right now is a weekly chart this blue line is a 10 week simple moving average on the S&P this right here that when we had put in what we referred to as that double bottom with this big short squeeze and we can see it right here and once we got to this point right there that's where we started this one week two week three week four weeks and basically uh the s p cannot break out and it cannot even test um it's uh 52 week high I got close to it but look at that blue line is a 10 week simple moving average and so when we start talking about weekly moving averages um, we'll be here to update you because um, I will give you the weekly moving averages to all of our uh, traders around the world so basically when we start looking at the 100 week simple moving average that's at 2029 when we start looking at the 50 week moving average that's at 2024 when we start looking at the um, 10 week moving average that's at 2059 right here that's that line that's that correction um, what will end up happening is is that between the bull and the bear um, the bull and the bear and what will end up happening is just like we came up off of the bottoms we're going to test these moving averages we will get a bounce it will take a little while but once all of these weekly moving averages get violated over the next you know week or so um the s p 500 is definitely in trouble
and that I am saying for sure. S&P 500, this is a put chart. And these contracts were down here at $15. And all of you people that have been trading uh, options, listen, man, you don't even have a, a, a put chart. I mean, come on, give me a break. Um, here, let me show you another one outside of that. Let's go back over here to the daily so that you can clearly understand um, what I'm talking about on the uh, S&P 2085 put option. All of you people love to trade. This is a big super trade right here. From $15, we went straight up. So a 10 contract is $15,000, and you're selling out up here at $40. Well, you do the math. Then it came right back down in that same 2085 put that was in the money, made another high up here, and that is the put option. And that is the put option that pays a significant amount of money, and that was on the 2085. I will also show you right here what the um, 2070 put had a $20 range today it was $9.80 so here's the low $8.85 there everybody this is super money and you know we make markets in the S&P 500 doesn't matter call side put side but these are humongous trades and you can get involved you know our turbo option trading dot com will get you just like that we're very excited you know we love sharing stuff with you because we do everything before the fact here's what the um 2060 put on the s p was today four dollars and eighty cents and it went to nineteen dollars and eighty cents do you realize if only 10 contracts you made fifteen thousand dollars why don't you go ahead and get with our TurboOptionTrading.com, 1,500 contracts traded, S&P 500 put options. Um, one of the other things that I'm going to show you also is that 2080 put, and I just showed the weekly charts now and the, and the daily charts. And here's what I'm going to tell you. These contracts were $12.90 over here, and they went to $35.90. That is super money. And when these things drop back down in the S&P 500 yesterday's rally, boy, we came back, and we came running and running and running. And here's another one that I'm going to show people. I'm going to go over here to that 2050, and I'm going to put that up there. And, you, you know, you option traders, listen, you can get here. Two dollars and fifty lousy cents. Ten contracts, twenty-five hundred dollars. Thirteen thousand twenty dollars would have been over here the value. Subtract the two, they were up ten point seven. Thirty contracts as well over thirty thousand. And you know, once again, everybody loves to trade options. You have not seen a twenty fifty put chart or call charts, but you know what? You need to ask yourself one thing. Why do you do what you do with no foundation? Here's the 2065 put. Here, again, the 2065, $7.20 with a huge move, 23.65. That's a $16. If you only had 10 contracts, we will put you in these trades. You will get these entries. You will get these exits. You will have the state-of-the-art um, call and put charts with the inflated and deflated. And you, too, will become the master S&P 500 on the calls, on the puts, and making a tremendous amount of money, like super big money.